There are many terms that healthcare professionals use to describe the locations of things relative to the rest of the body. They might seem confusing. We're going to make them easy. Superior. If something is superior to something else, it is above it. The knee is superior to the foot. The chest is superior to the waist. The head is superior to the neck. The opposite of superior is inferior. The foot is inferior to the knee. The waist is inferior to the chest. Proximal. If something is more proximal, it approximates the main mass of the body. The proximal end of the tibia is the end at the knee. The femur is more proximal than the tibia. The proximal end of the humerus is the end at the shoulder because this is the end that attaches to the main mass of the body. The opposite of proximal is distal. There is more distance between the distal end of something and the main mass of the body. The hand is more distal than the elbow. The distal end of the femur ends at the knee. Anterior and posterior refer to the front and the back. The face is on the anterior portion of the head. The buttocks are sometimes referred to as the posterior because they are in the back or behind portion of the body. Medial. If something is medial, it is closer to the middle. The medial end of the clavicle is the end closest to a line drawn down the center of the body. The clavicle is medial to the humerus. The opposite of medial is lateral. The lateral end of the clavicle is the end farthest away from a line drawn down the center of the body. Contralateral. Contra means opposite. If something is on the contralateral side, it is on the opposite side. If I say something contrary to what you said, I'm disagreeing with you and taking the opposite side. The right arm is contralateral to the left arm. The right arm is also contralateral to the left leg or foot or shoulder. The opposite of contralateral is ipsilateral. The right arm is ipsilateral to the right foot and contralateral to the left foot.